And welcome back to the long run where we are playing CrossCode A New Home. So last time we got a few pieces of Ascended gear. Um, the only piece of, uh, of Ascended legs that I can get right now is um, to do with the tower defense thing, which I kind of don't want to do. And the only headpiece that we can get right now uh, involves getting a bunch more um, anti-tokens. And I kind of don't really feel like doing that either. So we're just gonna roll with what we got. Alright, which one is yet? Apparently these, these two have decided to... Um... PvP rap battle. Okay, sure. Why not? Oh, there you are. Hi! There you are! Are you ready for our final duel? Great! Then let's get everything prepared. It's time for the final beating of Grasshead. Wow, everyone is watching, huh? No pressure, Leah! Why, of course I had to invite everyone to witness this great event. Two Sphermancers at the end of their journey. Engaging in one final duel to measure their skills. Truly, it will be a sight to behold. That's right, Grasshead. So when does it finally start? Now! We'll start now. PvP activate! <laughs> Good luck, Leah! Today is finally the day. We both walked the track, mastered all the elements, reached our full potential. Now the time has come to see which one of us has walked the right path. The path of the true Spermancer. The path of justice. Let the duel begin. Well, this is not going well for me. Ow. Stop! Ah, stop that! <sighs> well... Huh. <sighs> yeah, I thought I would do better than that too. At the same time, you're friggin' level 70, I think. Yeah. Oh, come on now. Really? Yeah, unfortunately, Apollo is like one of the hardest fights in the game. Oh, you're just getting warmed up, are you? Being ahead two to one, you're just you're warmed up. Okay, sure. Yeah, I should have gotten up to level seventy, but whatever.
And just the fact that he keeps canceling out my attacks, it's, uh, it's aggravating. Oh my freaking hell. I can do it. Yeah, four to one deficit. I can do it. Sure. This is, you know, five to three, right? That's game. This is what I call a proper fight. Spearman Sir Leah, you fought honorably. And I hope that this battle inspired you. For I am sure that your full potential is still within reach. Now, if you wish to challenge me to another duel, I suggest we hold it at the arena. And yes, we can now do a custom cup where we get to just fight Apollo. Spearman Sir Leah, thank you for the great duel. Thanks. It was a good fight, Leah. Yeah, it was a good fight, Leah. We, you tried your best. You can't always win. It's pretty late, so I gotta log off. It was a fun day, though. See you around. Bye. Looks like it's only us Iwotars now. It's a sign for us to return to our village. Actually, it looks like Trani already went to already went ahead, huh? See you in the neighborhood, Leah. Bye. All right. So time to go back home. Oh. Hi. Oh, welcome back, Leah. Did you like the new area? Yeah, it's pretty good. <laughs> I'll forward that feedback to the developers. Um, why? Mm -hmm. What's the matter? Maybe she's wondering what we're both up to. Obviously, we were discussing our plans to, uh, on achieving Iwutao supremacy. Care to join us? <laughs> <laughs> we were just having a little chat. Nothing special about it. Well, actually, I told Satoshi about my working relationship with Sidwell. I feel like I've had to, like I have to apologize for all the co all the things I've contributed to. Apology accepted. A lot of people are involved in the whole thing, being forced to do things they didn't stand for, just like Gotham. May he rest in peace. I don't think we've ever had the chance to meet before Homestead, did we? I don't think so. I suppose Sidwell must have had other people working for him without us being aware. So, what was it like working for him? And how did you get involved in the first place? Well, I still don't remember most things all that clearly, unfortunately. I think I was a student back then. I think someone got in touch with me over email. I guess in the end, it was just a little side gig. Watching specific players, gathering information, reporting back. He essentially earned money while playing a game. Why? I'm sorry, Leah. I really regret the whole thing ever since I've got to know you better. And then your avatar ended up here on the Evo on the Evo server. 
To me, that's the strangest part, really. Yeah, I can only guess why that happened. Maybe Sidwell want, uh, wanted access to more information from his employees. I suppose that might be. It's certainly useful to blackmail your people into submission. Let's hope that we'll find all the answers as my memory returns. I'm feeling tired. Is it time for a small nap? See you tomorrow. Bye. Good night. Hello, Leo. Hi. I'm currently at the cargo ship cargo ship to pay Carla and Jetta a small visit. We would love to see you again as well. So I activated the landmark in the cargo hold. Why don't you quickly drop by? Sure. So I guess I could not have gone to the cargo ship anyway. Now I can, though. There you are. Hi! I just wanted to make sure the teleporter still works. Actually, there is something else. Something I thought I would rather give you in private. Vermilion Arena Cup. Interesting. It is an arena cup with all sorts of battles you experience in Vermilion Wasteland including Gotham's ultimate experience. I thought you would have mixed feelings about this, but at the same time, this is Gotham's legacy. I am sure all these creations meant a great deal to him, so the thought of it all getting lost... If there is one thing Gotham would have wanted, it is to share his creations, right? That is why I created this cup. But I wanted to give it to you first. You are my beta tester, so to speak. If you feel up to the uh, if you feel up to the task, I will let you get your feedback on it. There is no rush. First, I will have to convince Entertainment to allow all these borderline game-breaking mechanics. Anyway, Jet and the others are waiting in the in the cabins on the third floor. I will go ahead. See you there. Okay, third floor. And here they are. Hi! Ah, there she is! Oh, there, girl. You're much lighter than I expected. Yeah, do not hug real people like that. Your instant matter might break. Sorry! <laughs> the way last I got clicky. Yeah, she tends to do that a lot these days. Let the girl have her hugs. It, it really has been a long time, you know. I heard things are going really well over at the playground. You got your own little village now, isn't that right? I really wish we could pay a visit, but we're all still very busy around here. I. What to do ever, ever since construction on the new game started? Hush, that is not supposed to be public yet. But yes, Incitainment is working on a successor to Crossroads right now. I suppose is it, is it, I suppose it is fine if you know about it. After all, you are unlikely to spread the news. <laughs> I mean, I guess. Looks like we'll have to take a few dozen more trips over the sea. What of it? Otherwise we'd be shipping things elsewhere. You have been on this moon for quite some time now. Do you not miss the old days working in intergalactic logistics? Nah, I'm used to all the water by now. What? Oh, you didn't know, Leo? Cappy, you used to work on a spaceship. I shipping things through the, through the sea of stars. Through the sea of stars? It's not as exciting as it sounds. Sea of stars, huh? A clear night sky like this it has always impressed me. Boundless Sea of Stars. The Boundless Sea of Stars. When you see it, you start to realize just how insignificant we are to this world. Oh, why? Is everything okay, Leah? You're probably you're probably tired. It's been it has been a long day for you, correct? Well, you have a warm bed to return to. It is time for me to leave as well, actually. 
It was really nice to see you all again. The pleasure was all ours. I still would, have, would never have guessed, guessed I'd meet you in this kind of getup. That is what games are for, correct? Doing things in unusual ways. <laughs> Until next time. Alright, time to get back to work. You're always welcome on this ship, girl. We already decided to, keep, to just keep that teleporter down in the cargo hold. See you around. Bye. Okay, so now we can uh, come to the cargo ship anytime. Um, I don't think there is particularly a reason to do that, but uh, maybe we can take our party over there? I don't know. Not that it's an especially thrilling place to go, but you know. Also, we've never seen the inside of, um... Hi. Hey. Hey there. Nothing special going on here, just watching the news. Feel free to join me. I appreciate that they gave us access to some of the broadcasting services. It's at least something to spend the time on. And strangely, it's still pretty interesting to watch the news. Even though it feels a bit pointless. Why? I mean, I don't think it's all that relevant to us what's happening out there. Unless they'd have breaking news of entertainment declaring bankruptcy. Uh, yeah, that would be pretty bad. Yep, that would be bad news to us. Actually, if you think about it, hasn't it always been this way? What? Like, hasn't most news been rather irrelevant to our life, even when we were, if, even back when we were outside of the game? You know, unless something, unless there's something happening in your town or a global catastrophe, it certainly doesn't make you stop worrying about whatever is happening out there in the world. Hi. That's enough news for today. Have a nice evening, then. Nice little place you got here. It'd be a shame if something were to happen to it. Spoilers, nothing ever happens to it. Oh shit, it's perfectly fine. And now try this. See this? Yeah, that wasn't that one isn't for everyone. You definitely won't need this for any hand signs. Why? Yes. Hi. Hello, Leah. Is something the matter? Who? Uh, who am I? I'm Citron, right? You should know. Who? That hand pose? Yes, I've shown that to you. Wanna practice the real thing the real thing again? How? Seriously, Leah, what's the matter? What? Uh, this? It's an image of a uh, starry sky. I do look I do like those a lot. The hand sign for star. You've shown it to me before, right? Who? You've shown it to me. Who? Leah. Sorry, Leah. I don't know who taught it to you. What? I'm pretty sure it wasn't me. I don't remember it at all. Who? Leah, please calm down. I told you, right? I just barely remember. I was a student. It was a side job. Why? Why what? Who? I told you, it wasn't me. Can we end this discussion now, please? I want to sleep. Wait! Who? Leah, I have no idea why you're screaming at me like this. 
I want to be alone. Can you please leave? Can you please leave? Why? Leah. Please wait right there. I am on my way. Please, Leah. And who is that now? Sorry for intruding. What? You both should be aware that you are being closely monitored, correct? Of course we are. So, what is happening here? Nina just suddenly entered and tried to ask me questions. And now she's just asking shouting question wars at me. Of course, it is hard for Leah to get her point across. But from what I followed, I might have an idea what this is about. Leah, I get the feeling that you know something about Citron that we do not. Could it be that you have a theory who Citron really is? Is it someone from your past memories? And the person who taught you that star sign? Well, I know for a fact that Shizuka never learned any hand signs. This is an experience unique to Leah, and there are very few people that have played a role in her past. It could not have been Gotham, Sh Satoshi, or Shizuka. It was Sidwell, correct? Sidwell taught you that star sign. So what? A lot of people know sign language, that's the whole point. Right. But then there is that weird hand pose with the bent fingers. I get the feeling it is related since I have seen Leah trying to do it herself frequently. Leah, could Sidwell do the same hand pose as well? I would consider that far less common to her. And that's why I'm Sidwell now? Just because I like stars, know a few hand signs, and can do things with my fingers? How is that supposed to prove anything? We all know very little about Sidwell. Leah might be the only person who, have had, uh, who had a somewhat close connection to him. She is our only lead to go on. That's unfortunate, but it doesn't make her claim any more valid. Why? Toby, please remember the situation you are in. You are here because of your connection to Sidwell. We expect you to cooperate. Alright then. I do remember. Leah being in her room. Me teaching her hand signs. All kinds of things. I guess you're right. It's the only way to explain it. I must have been Sidwell. All that time. I must have been playing crosswords a lot. Days, probably weeks on end. Always watching players gathering information. Why? Because I'm Sidwell! Don't you get it? I organized the whole thing. The Iwatar ground, all the intelligence gathering systems. I pulled the strings. I kept it all running. That's what I am. Sidwell the Iwatar, in person. Really, why are you keeping me in this village? Are you sure you don't want to delete me? Isn't that what I deserve? Toby, please. That name is fake and you know it. Same with Sidwell. You don't even know my real name. So, do you? <laughs> That's right. That's why I'm here. I almost forgot. You want to find him. You want justice. Of course, that's why you won't delete me. Wait. What is it? Am I not right? I'm your only source of information. That's why I'm here. Wait. What is this now? Wait. Could you maybe stop doing this? Sorry. Hugging isn't a fix for everything, Leah. You shouldn't hug the person that ruined your life. Thanks. Uh, what? Why are you thanking me? Are you entirely broken now? What is wrong with you? Toby, please calm down. Remember, he spent a lot of time with Leah, playing crossroads together as friends. You should not forget about that. Really now? Despite the fact that I've been deceiving you the whole time? <laughs> this is stupid. So stupid. I... 
I don't get it. Really. I don't even understand myself. All this time, ever since we've been playing together, I've been feeling this incredible dread. I didn't want it to end. I didn't want you to find out. I wish things could, would have been different. Why would I... Why would Sid will ever feel this way? Next time you plan to interrogate someone, please let me know first. I understand that all of this must be quite personal to you, but we all want to learn the whole story. And we definitely need your and we definitely need to collaborate to get there. Sorry. Well, today I was certainly an important step. I just hope that Citron remembers more of his past. Because I'm still puzzled about the fact that he ended up on that Evotar server. Especially if he is uh, if he truly is Sidwell's Evotar. I'll be going then. Make sure to get some sleep, Leah. Bye. Well, that was, uh, that was intense. I'll get some shut eye, though. What's the matter? Why not? Ice cream is great. I know, I told you I'm not big on sweets. But ice cream is a different matter. Oh, is it that late already? Sorry, I need to go. This is a message to myself. It will serve as a reminder for my upcoming tasks. My main objective is to gather intelligence on our living, our, on our investigation targets from within the game. This task will require my continuous attendance in Crossworlds for a prolonged period. So it looks like we might have something else to do before we can go to that final dungeon. Wake up, sleepyhead. <laughs> Good morning. Long time no see. Hi! That part didn't change at all, huh? Sorry for not showing up before. I was kind of busy. No time to get back into the game. To be perfectly honest, I needed some distance. Too many bad things happened here. Sorry. Still with the apologizing. It's fine. I'm feeling better now. You really did a great job with this village. This is such a cute place to stay in. Thanks! Hey, I was actually planning to pay my brother a small visit as well. Want to come with, want to come with me? Great. Take your time to get ready since you just woke up. And again, does that even apply for you, Evotars? I'll wait in front of Satoshi's house. See you there. She's a lot friendlier now, isn't she? I'll just stand in front of the sink for a second, as we seem to be want to do. Actually, let's see who's online. Uh, Aaron? Oh, Toby's not online. And also, uh, Real Lucas is not online. Okay then, let's see what my big brother is up to. And of course, she has the same smug face as, uh, as Leah, since they are Technically the same person. 
Satoshi. Hi. Sister. What are you doing? Working. Can't there be a time in your life when you're not doing that? It's part of the agreement. Yes, yes, there's, also, there's always an agreement. It's a big reason why Incitainment supports us. They wanted me back, so I can work for them. Seriously, though. Constantly working like that can't be good for you, even being an Evotar. You know, I'm honestly feeling much more resilient this way. Of course you'd say that. No, really, I feel great. Yeah, you look like you feel great, buddy. You just fell over. Yeah, this happens sometimes. It's no big deal. See? All good. Alright, that does it. You, sir, are going to get some fresh air. Well, you know about the new area they just released, right? Of course I do. I'm involved in development. It seems like a lovely place. You n actually never went there, did you? No. Alright then, let's go there together. But right now, let's take a break and visit those islands. But I'm busy. No buts. I checked with Sergei and the others. It's not like you're on a tight schedule right now. Well, for th uh, the official projects, that is. Really, you got your own pet projects again. Alright, fine. Great, let's go. It's really about time that we both complete that part of the game. You know that the big release will happen later today, right? That's true. I'm sure there'll be a huge crowd, though. What? Oh, that's right. It's not really public yet, is it? For whatever reason, they decided to just shadow drop it tonight. The final dungeon, dungeon will finally be released. I think they were planning to release the news just about now. Oh, someone's getting a call. Leah! They're finally releasing it! The final dungeon! What's with that reaction? Wait, don't tell me you already knew! But the news just got out! Ah, uh, you and your close developer connections. Anyway, the whole guild is planning to run the dungeon together. We want to meet soon to plan the whole thing. However, they decided to meet in the City Hall of Homestead this time. So, see you there. Bye! Seems like your friends got the news. We'll be going then. I'd like us to be ready in time as well. See you at the dungeon. Bye! Until then. Alright then, where to start? I should probably get better equipment first. Is... is that gear from Gaia's Garden? Why are you only level 48? There was never a need to level this character any further. We've really got some work to do. <laughs> well, at least he's 48. I mean, that's not a terrible level. Anyway. Um, we definitely are going to need some... Um, we, we definitely are going to have some, some meta story things to do, but um, keep in mind it's been a while since I've actually finished this game, so I didn't remember if the final dungeon came first or the meta story stuff, and it seems like we're doing this first. Leah dear, you're here! It looks like everyone's here. Oh, except for Troni. Strange, he's usually not the type to be late. Now that I think about it, he didn't seem all that enthusiastic when I contacted him. Leah, do you mind quickly dropping by at his place to see what he's up to? Sure. Thank you, dear. Who are you waiting here? Um... Quick drink of water. And, uh, which one is Toby's house? Wait a minute. The misspelled Toby. <laughs> I'm guessing that's probably how his name is spelled in French. Because it's a short form of Tobias, which is T-O-B-I-A-S. 
Uh, so it makes French that some languages might spell the short version T-O-B-I. Hi. Hello, Leah. Neat. Are you here to tell me about the meeting for the new dungeon? I know about it. But to be honest, I'm not sure if I should join. Playing along with everyone else? You know, yesterday I told you the truth, Leah. Don't you think it'd be fair to let the others know as well? Wait. Too soon, huh? Uh, I suppose. And there is still the chance I might remember something important. At least I feel like something is still missing. What? I wish I knew. It might be just wishful thinking, really. You know... Maybe running the dungeon with everyone is a good a good idea to take my mind off it. Okie dokie. Let's go to that meeting. Welcome everyone to the lovely City Hall. The rumors have been around for quite some time, but today it'll finally happen. The final temple will open. The last trial for us seekers to take. We, it's dungeon time. We should all do a race together. No, oh, that again. No, thank you. I'd rather take my time. Yeah, we grandpas should take. Would we grandpas should take things slowly? <laughs> huh? I agree. I'd rather not rush through it, but enjoy it at my own pace. But our racing tradition. Yeah, you will still join the race, no? So, as far as I know, it's just you and me in chat right now, Jewel. What do you think? Alright. Ha! I knew I could count on you, Shay. First Scholars! We heard you're, you're preparing an event to tackle the final temple. We'd like to be part of this honorable endeavor. Yes, please. Of course, take a seat. Alrighty, everyone. Not really much to say here. Let's bring the temple together. Those who want to race can race. Let's all meet in front of the temple tonight when it opens, eh? Please no spoiling it. Uh, please no spoiling until everyone is finished. Roger, ma'am. Everyone, make sure your gear is upgraded. Hey, I wanted to say that. The time has come for us seekers to finally complete this journey. Hey, Apollo, this is my spot up here. All right. So before we do anything, um, we are getting up to level 70. Um, and we're probably going to be starting on... Cool. Cool dead zone issues, bro. Hmm. Well, that's unpleasant. All right, I guess I'm gonna have to configure this. Um, let's see. Actually, yeah, that might be a good idea, cause um, I think there, I think this cable might be a little bit crappy, honestly. Nope. Still got dead zone issues. Uh, so yeah, I am going to have to recalibrate them real quick. Give me a second. Sorry about this, guys, but technology is not infallible. Uh, controller, general controller settings. Calibrate. Um, start full auto calibration.
Yeah, I don't know why the um why it's drifting so badly right now. Uh I wonder if it's not like a similar issue to what um Joy-Cons experience. I might I might just have to like um clean the clean this out or something. I'm not really sure how I'd go about that though. It's not as easy as um as it would be with uh how would I even go about opening this? Oh well, anyway. Uh so yeah, close this. Uh, there we go. That uh, sounds good, Joel. Uh, let's see. Well, let's see if I can get a booster for Azure Archipelago. Yeah, I don't think that anything real that important is going to end up happening. Let's see. There's booster, game booster, value booster, trail booster, fall booster, rise booster. There is no booster for our Belgo. At least not yet. I have the garden booster. Ryan's Trail Valley Falls. They don't have the special item for it, so. Actually, I think what we should be doing is um, get those quests done. Because I was gonna do that before fighting um, Monsieur Grasshead. And I need some spice sets, I believe. One more fruit set. Okay. That should be something that I can just find right here. Theoretically. Good. Enjoy good egg. Me leave. More business. Not follow. Wait! The one gold surprise eggs turned out to just be trash. It was a scam. How? Um... That actually gave us a trash item. I just want to see the, um, the description for it. Why did you pick that up? Oh! I didn't realize I could actually break these. Interesting. 
That doesn't count as bot me, does it? Um... Yeah, no, it doesn't. The most beautiful flower in the trash bag. Hi, meat. Where? Ah, Spox! Human, go away. Wait! Um, hang on. I think I'm good on chef sandwiches, especially since chef sandwiches take a long time to eat. I don't want to depend too much on those, but high sandwiches I can definitely stock up on. Gathering trash for really no discernible reason. Wait! Spark! Human seeker! Danger! Well, who'd have thunk it? Why can I not hit you? I think you I think it was like elevated by that chair or something. Ow. Oh come on now. And the geometry of this room is is uh, very unaccommodating. The items and money lost in the scam have been retrieved. That is a lot of stuff too. So pho photosensitivity warning, by the way. Leah, wait. Why? Wait. Also, I like the uh, the special uh, combat music for this uh, for this encounter. Geez, I just realized. Okay, or you know, you can screw yourselves up. 
too. That's also cool. All right, time for the main course. Ah! It's trying to launch the bomb at it, but uh... Apparently bombs don't phase you at all. Oh jeez. You're still being a pest. You know what? You're being a pest somewhere that you generally can't bomb. Out of the way. We leveled up though to level 69. Bone hurdy juice. Hi? Seeker, nice greetings. Leah, hi. How? Why? Oh, I am sorry, Seeker. Why? Much happened. I must go. Wait! How? Why? <coughs> Goodbye, Seeker. Wait! Why? Meet Leah. Sorry. We're sorry you have to meet Leah and get punched in the face. Okay. Well, that's something that's happening. Oh, jeez. Oh, that's a lot of things happening all at once. Phase two, now phase three. God, mm, I was trying to do, um, I was trying to do a dash like this.
almost. There we go. Okay. Right, downstairs. Hi! You're back. One of our patrols have sighted a fl uh, flying transport leaving the city toward the south. Also some, and I quote, epic showdown on a rooftop. Seems like you've made quite the show of your investigation, Seeker. How? Meet Leah. Well, I don't give a flying nut about your uh, methods, as long as they don't involve property damage or bad press. And you did rid us of the infamous young head of the Papa Gang, that should clip their wings for some time. So, good job, Peer Seeker. As for that mysterious transport, where? We checked with the Coastal Guard, and it is head headed directly to Roma Square. Bye! Yes, goodbye, Seeker, and good luck. So that's that quest done. Um, we need to cliff exhibition in Roma Square. Something that I wanted to check as well. I don't remember exactly where it is. Yeah. That's the normal way. How do I get over there? It's kind of a dead space that I can't get into. And it's also blocked off there. Is there anything interesting in there? Oh, wait. Ah, here we go. And we've discovered, uh, oh, we've discovered this. Two burned ash. All right. I don't think that's enough to get, uh, any of the Ascended gear, though. Anyway, Cliff, uh, cliff Exhibition. Ah, yes, here is Vibromatic. Ah, okay. You got the Shuddering Cleaver completed! Kirika! Talk to me again when you're ready for the next part. So we got the Shuddering com Cleaver completed. We can tackle the, the last part now. How? There is a final part missing. The core that my Gramps put into a dangerous war machine. 
Why? It was his duty as a craftsman, but it became too dangerous, so he stealed it away. So now it rests on our old labor in our old laboratory in the remote building on on Cliff Exhibition here in Ronda Square. Here, this is the key to the door. The machine will react to the weapon and awaken. They destroy it and bring me its core so I can finally leave this shaking behind. Please. Bye. That is hard on the arm. There's probably a better way to do that too, but... Oops. Direct, directly into the water, like a genius. I would think the traffic is so heavy here, I could just... Okay, there we go. Okay, so that's one quest, and I think... The other is in one of those buildings over there. Ah. There we go. Here we go. I believe this would be an instanced room anyway, so assembling a party would not really help. Or if this isn't an instance room, like the the next room is. Awaken the machine. I am the machine. What level are you? Sixty seven. Okay. Oh, you're excited. Okay. Pretty sure I do need to attack with uh, with Spark in order to disperse the aura. Um, sandwich. Just got it in. close. Ah, 
Ah. Freaking hell. That was so close, too. Ashes. I freaking short range the songs, the song storms. Okay, this is once again going badly. I'm not sure if he has his aura up or not. Looks like it's no. That did full damage. There we go. Okay, so now that problem has been dealt with, let's go deal with the other problem. Also there's a problem of how the heck do I get that? Oh, I see, I see. There we go. It's an antique token. Awesome. Always wanted one of those. This area is locked for to this area is locked for unauthorized trespassers. Move along, there's nothing to see here. Hi, Leah. Why? Neat. I see, I see. You're one of the seekers on an official mission from the local guard. Those country bumpkins from Bergen Village sure put a lot of trust into some adventurer. Why? Relax, I'm not interested in arguing over the Seeker Defense Assistance Clause with you or my supervisors. You can handle this goat problem that Bergen left to us, and I'll even give you an up-to-date briefing. How's that? What? How? Why? Okay, listen. Those goats you are hunting have violently occupied the building behind us. It's the Rhombus Parks Embassy. Take care of the local parks. Uh, takes care of the local parks and sends researchers to the mainland. 
Maybe the goats want to munch on some rare plants or steal hoof research. I don't know and I don't care. Point is, Seeker, they are occupying the building, holding hostages, and they keep bleeding all day. That's gotta stop. You following? Fine. Then go ahead and detain those terrorist goats. We'll, keep, we'll continue to secure the area here. Bye. That's a lot of goats. Hi, Leah. Why? Seeker, this is place of goat now. Leave. How? Meat. Why? No talk. Leave or fight. <laughs> Just completely uh, demolish the um, the front desk. Not pay any attention to uh, to your allies here. Okay, I have to turn that off for a second. Ow! The slaughter us once. It's the goat father. <laughs> Too many goat lives have been lost already. I will handle this myself. Hi, Leah. We goats claim this place. We won't leave peacefully. Why? It is the rules of nature, Seeker. If you won't relent, a duel, shall uh, a duel between us shall decide the fates of goats and humans. Meet Leah. I've actually done this fight recently, I just don't remember how to do it. I probably also had better gear than this. Okay, that was, uh... Oh, come on! Yeah. 
I think uh, zero. We can safely say. Looks like we both have different ways of spelling that. <laughs> this friggin' Don Maku crap here. of good kind lies in your hand, but now finish me. Ain't gonna happen, buddy. My near meat, how? You think man can and goat can coexist here in peace? But how? How? Hi, Gu. Seeker and boss, greetings and good news. Yes, good day everyone. We just finished an important meeting and bring a proposition. Zero, you held negotiations with humans behind my back. Yes, father. Ghosts will have to adapt and cooperate to live good lives here in this city. How? Who? Well, there are ways. I represent large property holdings in this area, and was contacted by Miss Zira here. Despite her rage, she was a great negotiator and most persuasive. After communicating with the city council, we found a few solutions that should be satisfying to all, hooved or not. Leah, how? It's obvious that these intelligent ghosts bring a very specialized skill set that can turn into a valuable business. Also, Miss Zira created a deposit to buy the local properties with the valuable goods she, bought, she brought. Oh, what? How? I was very busy and planned a lot. It seems like my smart daughter has done a lot of work while her father was just, uh, just stubbornly prepared for his defeat. Very well, I shall listen to these propositions of yours, for the well-being of all good kind. Splendid. You won't be disappointed, sir. Please, let us, let us continue this in our office. Fine, let us go. Seeker, goodbye. Goodbye, Seeker, and thank you for everything. Bye. That brings us to level 30. Unnice. So after that uh, wild goat chase, Let's go back to that homestead. Let's go back to Bergen Village and uh, turn in that quest. It's okay. 69 can live on in our hearts and in our beds. Hi! Seeker, I've already heard the reports. It feels like you traveled half of Shadoon to crack this case. Impressive work. It seems like coexistence of the ghosts actually was possible, after some persuasion. Where it is, they even established a business, selling goat-related products in some park, if you believe it. Well, whatever the case, it is now in the hands of Rhombus Square. Hopefully the ghosts finally found a home there without causing further trouble. As for you, you have once again earned our thanks and, our, and this reward. Bergen, th 
Bergen Village is in your debt. Bye. Alright, that gives us a bunch more circuit points to work with and an asteroid chunk. I know what I said. Um, let's see. Wow, that's a lot of circuit points for us to spend. She has not increase the damage taking while guarding. Yeah. Defense up is definitely a good thing. And does anything cost two? I doubt it at this point. Uh, this is Gardar, yeah, yeah. Uh, burn rush. Such a good name. So many options. Yeah, that would... Guard attacks from the side. Actually, twice to guard attacks from above, too. I would never actually remember that. Slows down elemental overload. I'm Good with that. And crit damage. We have a big seven points here. This is a sense of shock. I don't think there's anything else that I can spend one point on. Well, that's most of our points spent. Okay. Um. Ah, yes. Report back to Miss Tremor. Uh, and she was in this building. Seeker, you're back, and you got the core? That, that is great. I can't believe I'll finally be free again. I will complete the weapon. That will lift the curse, I hope. Beep boop up. I'm a robot. It, it is gone? The shaking stopped? Huzzah! This feeling, 
It's liberating and peaceful at once. Seeker, I can't thank you enough. Mia. Well, you can you can take the completed weapon with you. It is immensely powerful, and that curse is lifted too. And I could even make it ascend if you bring me the needed material. Mia, meet. Bye. Yes, goodbye, and thank you again. Thrashing Ripper, level 68 natural? Wow. And apparent. Okay. So I can upgrade a Sonic Spike into a Nanopoint Needle. And the Thrashing Ripper we just got for a Tremor Mirage. But I need a crap ton of stuff from the final dungeon for this. So... Um, let's do one more quest. And then I think next week is going to be an end or bust stream. Hopefully I can get the entire thing done in six hours or less. Uh, let's see. So let's go with this one. Oh. This one might take a while. You know what? Let's do it anyway. Um, Arena Plaza. Excuse me, Jolmara. I think you misunderstand the concept of end or bust. Either that or have your own concept, which I want nothing to do with. Okay. Oh, Arena Lobby. I want Arena Plaza, which is outside. Yeah. Hey, you. Hi. Yes, you. Um, Seeker, wasn't it? We have a quest for you. Do we really need to get others involved in this? Yes, I've had my fill of chasing after him. Also, she probably knows this place better than we do, don't you think? True. So, yeah, we're looking for a certain troublemaker. He's strolling around somewhere in this world. Can you help us find him? Sure thing. That'll give us a circuit point in every board. Thank you so much. I'm Lily. Nice to meet you. Leah. I'm Priel. Thanks for... Thanks for helping us. Now about the guy we're looking for. He's rather small, black hair. What's his class again? Pentafist? Uh, power fist? Pentafist. Right, and finally he's notorious for wandering all over the place. In fact, he, see he tends to go everywhere except for where you want him to be. Why don't we try to contact him together? No, oh, we can do that? I think. Let's give it a try. Ah, it's the beeping that, that beeping thing again that makes everything bluish. Stop complaining. See this guy, Leo? This is Rise. Hi. Um, hello. Why is she here? We got her to help uh, to help us pick you up. I told you I don't. You don't need to look for me. I'm already on my way to you. Yes, and we've been waiting for hours. Where are you right now? Uh, let me see. I'm on this snowy mountain. There's a little house close by. Somebody told me there's a town when I go further up the mountain. That's Ramba Square, right? No, Rise. I think that's Bergen Village. Oh. Okay, enough of that. You just wait where you are, okay? Me will pick you up and bring you to us. I told you, you know, I said wait. Fine. Okay, looks like we're all set. But look on your search. If there are any troubles, you can call me via this D-Link. Yeah, this quest is gonna take us around. So this stream might end up going a little long. Not too long, but a little long. Hmm. 
Why are there hedgehogs here? Hey, thanks for taking care of those. Mia, how in the world did a bunch of high-level hedgehogs even end up in this place? From what I saw, there was a, this small black-haired guy that was being chased around by them. They probably lost track of him and then just stuck around. I guess. Anyway, we gotta go. Bye. Bye. Hi. Hey, Leah. How's it going? Let me guess. He's not there. Oh dear, let me try to contact him again. Oh, hey! Hi. Dude, we told you to wait. Yeah, you see, I was being chased by a bunch of hedgehogs that wouldn't leave me alone. Wait, they they chased you to this high up they chased you this high up the Bergen Trail? How? I I tried to feed them, but then they got angry somehow. You're not supposed to feed them. Well, Ivo wanted me to try something. Ah, fingers. Anyways, I, it seems I got rid of him. So, where are you right now? I actually found that Bergen Town, but I had to keep going and now I'm in this desert. Why don't you just stop moving? I thought you escaped those hedgehogs. Yeah, but not the penguins. They're still after me. And they're fast. I gotta go. Where are you? Uh, I don't know. Oh, wait, there's this huge pink tree close by. Bye. Ah. Well, maybe you can help him with this little penguin problem. Let's hope he'll, uh, he'll be there this time, at least. Oh, at least it, that gave us a level up. So I'm sure you can guess what's going to happen. Yep, sure enough. Penguins and also um, vault turbines, which for some reason are level 70, which doesn't happen naturally. Yep. Okay. Um. Why freaking got interrupted? So apparently I only need to kill the penguins? Why? Oh, right, because the other the, the vault turbines are native to here, duh. Hi. Fun again? I swear, one day I'm gonna kill that guy. Um, hello. You. Why? Wait. Where are you now? Well, you see... Somebody was so kind to tell me and uh, I was heading in the wrong direction. Tell me something new. You were supposed to wait again. It's okay. I'm very close to Rama Square now, I think. Rise, stop moving. Rama Square was close to that jungle, wasn't it? No, no it wasn't. Oh crap, they're closing in again. You're still being followed? Yeah, and also there are these huge mushrooms everywhere. Ah, where am I? Wait! Rise for the love of crap, stay where you are. Sorry, I gotta run. No! You know what? Maybe we should just leave him to his fate. I feel like he deserves to be smashed by whatever's following him. Come on, don't be that way. Why are those enemies following him so aggressively anyway? 
This really doesn't seem normal, right, Leah? I bet Ivo's up to something again. Why? Oh, right, we never told you about Ivo. He's a friend of ours. He's not in this world, though. Instead, he's sort of checking what we're doing, I think. Who knows what he's up to, really? In practice, he's like an annoying voice in your head that talks to you occasionally. Sounds like a very helpful fellow. <laughs> in any case, let's not give up on Rise, okay? Fine, we'll give him a last chance. You better hurry before he wanders off again. So this hint is less specific, but we know he's in the infest marshes somewhere. Wait. Um. Oh right, I need to hit the Tim with fire first. <laughs> and then dash into the water because, of course, Oh, and some more of them. Cool. Alright. Um. Oh. Still need to get one more hit. Oh, jeez. Um. And then I jump my myself to death. Oh boy. Alright. Right. I guess let's take care of you first. trying to push him into the water, but uh, apparently the game decided not to have any of that. Okay, that's the first wave done. Oh, 
Also, why are you guys just watching? Like, these two guys over here. They're just watching you go. Like, not helping at all. Maybe they're like not my level or something, and there is a mechanic in Cross Worlds where if you don't engage in combat, um, enemies that are in combat can't hurt you. Okay, one of them is down. That's an advantage already. And then I get cornered and... God damn it! Holy crap. This stream is gonna go for a while is because I'm gonna play like an idiot apparently. Maybe I'm getting tired. Also be my less than ideal gear, but the the amount of uh, the amount of grinding is, that I need to do to get that gear now is like not something that I want to do on stream. Oh my goodness. Okay, two of them down. There goes the other one. Now I just have the tin to worry about. Well, that was painful. Hey, thanks for clearing up this mess. Seriously, how did that even happen? Hey, Leah. So it seems like there's this huge commotion going on to the south of the arena. Yes, there's all kinds of random enemies there. And we all know what that means. Rise must be closed. I'm sorry for all the trouble, but your help would be really appreciated right now. Um, you know what? I think I need to call in the cavalry. Sorry, you, we, we've had a request. Oh right, she's busy with, uh, with her brother. Uh, sorry, we can't, we cannot, um, fulfill your request. Okay, how do how do they even have access to the tramway?
to I'll try to get rid of these ranged fish first. Um, there we go. Oh, these jerks again. Fortunately, I have sufficient enough geometry to work with that I can just escape, use a sandwich, and come back. Unless they corner me like that, holy crap. For a very twisted definition of um, of cool there, Jewel. And yeah, that, that would be an awkward situation in real life, Zero. Fortunately, this is only a simulation of real life. Hey there, Leah. That was quite the mess, wasn't it? Now, where is our little troublemaker? Ah, there you are. Rise! What the heck, dude? Seriously, what have you and Ivo been up to again? Well, Ivo wanted me to try out a few things with those enemies. He gave me a few items and told me to feed them. And ever since, it didn't stop following me. Oh, bother. Wasn't it Ivo who told, who told us not to draw too much attention? Yeah, so much for that. Oh, uh, well, whatever. The problem has been solved, right? No more enemies follow me around, so we're good. We wouldn't have this kind of trouble if you just stayed still. I still don't get why it was so hard for you to find the arena. You could have just teleported there, you know. What? What do you mean teleported? Did... did you really walk to all of those locations? Of course, I didn't even know you could teleport. Ah! I probably should have mentioned this earlier. Anyway, what's done is done. Let's finally go to the arena. Yes, even I should be f able to find the way right now. The right way now. Let's go. Wait. Wow, that's such a huge place. Yeah, really makes you wonder how you could miss it. Walking around right next to it. Yeah, I guess. Now, time to try this PvP thing. 
At least I heard the arena is the best place to fight each other. Yeah, let's do it. How about you join the fun as well, Leah? Alright, let's go! You over there. You with the yellow scarf. Huh? Yes, you. A lot of players report you've been hacking the system and pulling enemies across locations. Oh yeah, about that. Listen, I... This is a clear violation of our, of our terms of use. You'll have to be banned. Sorry. Wait, I never intended... I don't believe you've been involved in any of this, right? Nope. No idea who that guy was. <laughs> Same. Alright then. Enjoy your stay in Crossworlds. Well, he had it coming. <sighs> I have those getting on my nerves now. Apparently Rise is all confused. I better tell him what happened. Should I go as well? Why don't you try this PvP thing with Leah? Leah! At least one person should have some fun here, right? Sure, if that's okay with you. But before you leave, make sure it gives to give Leah her reward. Right. I mean, chasing that little troublemaker turned out, turned out to be t entirely fruitless, but still. Here's a little something for all your trouble. So, a bunch of stones and uh, circuit points for all of the elements. And a bunch of money, too. Well then, I gotta go now. You two have fun at the arena. Thanks, and see you later. Bye! Alright then, Leah, let's go! Here we are, such a busy, such a busy place. Now then, if I understand this correctly, you can configure custom cups and do PvP battle challenges that way. Let me give it a try. We're all set, ready when you are. Just select PvP with Lily among the custom cups to the right. And we're pretty much just gonna leave her hanging for an undefined period of time. It's fine. Also, we get to see what happens when someone gets banned from the game. That was kinda cool. Uh, let's get out of the way of people here. Stop standing in the bushes. There we go. Yep, this is fine. Anyway, and that was quite the adventure, and as I expected, we ended up staying a little bit longer as a result. But um, it was fun, and next week we should be able to um, finish this up. So, uh, that is gonna do it for today. I want to thank y'all for watching. We had Jill Mara, of course. We had uh, Donut for the first time on this channel. We had Zero. Maybe some other people. Who knows? The next scheduled stream is, uh, you would think it's tomorrow, but no. Um, the co-creator stream are on hiatus for now. Uh, mainly because I do need to worry about the whole viewer account thing, and it's not particularly fun, but if I want to get affiliate, gotta do the thing. Um, so as a result, no stream tomorrow. Um, the next scheduled stream as a result is going to be on Saturday. Uh, Saturday at 9pm Atlantic uh, Daylight Time. We're going to be doing the extra long run. I guess if I didn't stream for 30 days of well, I don't know, it depends on if I had... Maybe, Jewel, but I'm not going to stop streaming for a month just to get affiliate. Anyway. Uh, so yes, on Saturday at 9 p.m. Atlantic Daylight Time, we're going to have the extra long run. Um, there is a game that I want to play that I was going to wait until we were done with CrossCode, 
But at the same time, I don't really want to wait to start playing it. <laughs> so we're going to start playing it on Saturday. Um, and uh, yeah, so don't forget to tune in uh, for this new game that we're going to be playing. That's your hint. Um, the next stream after that is going to be the Sunday Super Shuffle, Sunday at 7.30pm or later, Atlantic Standard Time, Atlantic Daylight Time, um, and we are going to do some more Archipelago. Hopefully 0 0.3.0 .0 will be out, which means that Meredith will be officially uh, part of Archipelago and not just hacked in on our server, uh, as well as a couple of other games. So. That should be pretty fun. Um, actually, Zero, I don't know how interested you are in... Uh, I, I guess you're not too interested in uh, Link to the Past, but SMZ3 is going to be an option with the new update. So, food for thought, I guess. Um, that brings us around the wheel, around the week, to our next um, regular long run stream where we're probably going to finish CrossCode. Uh, also, uh, during this weekend, I probably am going to have some matchups in the uh, Super Smash TV tournament. Um, so I will necessarily have to stream my end, um, which will probably not garner a whole lot of viewers, unfortunately, but them's the rules. Uh, so if you want to come support me, I would greatly appreciate it. Um, and uh, yeah, unfortunately, there's not going to be there's probably not going to be any announcements as to when that's happening. But I'll try to let people know. So yeah, I don't think anyone is streaming that I usually uh, raid to, so I will um, leave you guys to do whatever you wish. So thank you all for watching. I'm Coolio if you don't know, and I'll see you guys next time.